Hello viewers, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to discuss pyrrole, its methods of synthesis, reactions and medicinal uses. Let us see the structure of pyrrole and its numbering system. We can see your five membered ring containing nitrogen atom is called as pyrrole. It contains one nitrogen atom and four carbon atoms. So the numbering will start from the hetero atom. This nitrogen will get number one position. This carbon will get two. This is three, four and five. You can either number it clockwise or you can number it anticlockwise. It is one and the same. Another way of numbering pyrrole ring is by alpha and beta position. So the carbon which is immediately attached to the hetero atom will get alpha position whereas the carbon which is attached to the alpha carbon will get beta position. Similarly, this will be alpha dash and this will be beta dash. Now let us discuss the physical properties of pyrrole. Pyrrole is a colorless liquid. It has an odor of chloroform. The boiling point of pyrrole is 131 degrees Celsius. It is very slightly soluble in water and soluble in most of the organic solids. The vapors of pyrrole turn pine splint when moistened with HCl and red in color. Hence, it is named as pyrrole. Now, let us discuss the different methods for preparation of pyrrole. The first method is nor pyrrole synthesis. In this method, there is a condensation of alpha amino ketone. You can see here, this is an alpha amino ketone. It reacts with beta keto ester to give substituted pyrrole. So, we can see here, this alpha amino ketone, it is attacking on this carbonyl carbon and we are getting a cyclic structure wherein there is a ring closure and we will get 2, 5 substituted pyrrole. The second method for synthesis of pyrrole is Hansch pyrrole synthesis. In Hansch pyrrole synthesis, there is a condensation between chloroacetone, beta keto ester and a primary amine. The first step of the reaction involves condensation of beta keto ester and primary amine and the product of which combines with chloroacetone to give the pyrrole derivative. Let us see the reaction. We have this beta keto ester. It is reacting with the amine and further it will undergo different steps of cyclization leading to the formation of this cyclic structure which is substituted with a acetone group. The third method for preparation of pyrrole is piloty robinson synthesis. In this method, ketazines, they are treated with strong acids to give pyrrole through a sigma tropic rearrangement of tautomeric divinyl hydrazine. You can see here, this ketazines, they are undergoing a sigma tropic rearrangement that is a 3,3 sigma tropic rearrangement and we are getting this final compound of pyrrol which is substituted at different positions. Fourth method is by treatment with ammonia. So pyrrol can be manufactured by passing a mixture of furan with ammonia and steam over red hot alumina as a catalyst and we will get pyrrol structure. Fifth method is by distillation that is on distillation of succinamide with zinc dust pyrrol can be obtained. Now let us see the reactions of pyrrol. Pyrrol undergoes electrophilic aromatic substitution reaction at second position. Now why only at second position and why not at any other position? So let us see that if the attack of electrophile is taking place at third position, then we are getting 
two resonating structures. Whereas if the attack is taking place at second position, that is the electrophile, electrophile is attacking at the second position, then we are getting the three resonating structures. So according to theory of resonance, more the number of resonating structures, more stable is the compound. Hence, attack at second position is favored. Now let us discuss the different electrophilic substitution reaction which pyrrol undergoes. So the first is nitration. That is, nitration is usually carried out with nitric acid at lower temperature around minus 10 degrees Celsius. So pyrrol on treatment with HNO3, we are getting 2 nitro pyrrol. Similarly, on sulfonation, that is pyrrol on sulfonation in presence of pyridine and sulfur trioxide, we are getting 2 pyrrol sulfonic acid in 90% yield. Third reaction is halogenation, that is pyrrol on bromination, it is giving us 2 bromo pyrrol. This bromine group is attached at the second position. Friedel-Crafts oscillation, that is pyrrol is reacting rapidly with acetic anhydride and SNCl2. So we get 2 acetyl pyrrol. This acetyl group is attached at the second position. This was all about electrophilic substitution reaction. Other reaction which pyrrol undergoes includes oxidation. That is pyrrol is oxidized with chromium trioxide in acetic acid. So we are getting this malinamide which is an amide of malic acid. Similarly, pyrrol on reduction with zinc and acetic acid, it gives 2,5-dihydropyrrol, which on reduction with HI and red hot phosphorus gives pyrrolidine. So, pyrrol on reduction gives pyrrolidine, whereas pyrrol on oxidation, it is giving us malinamide. Formylation reaction, pyrrol also undergoes formylation reaction. The best example is Raymer Timon reaction. This occurs in presence of strong base and chloroform, and pyrrol undergoes Raymer Timon reaction at second position to form 2 pyrrol aldehyde. So you can see here this chloroform will dissociate to give CCl3 minus ions. This CCl3 minus ions will further dissociate to give CCl2 and chloride ions. This CCl2 will attack on the pyrrol ring and we will get two different products that is pyrrol 2 aldehyde and the second product is of ring expansion wherein this 5 membered ring will be converted to 6 membered ring so we call it as ring expansion. And the product obtained is 3 chloropyridine. Next reaction which pyrrol undergoes that is Hauben Hoesch reaction, that is the reaction of pyrrol with aliphatic nitrile and hydrochloric acid. In presence of Lewis acid, it introduces an acyl group at the alpha position of the pyrrol nucleus. Kolbe-Schmidt reaction, which is a carboxylation reaction like phenols, pyrrols also react with CO2 to yield carboxylic acid. So you can see here pyrrol is reacting with CO2 and we are getting this carboxylic acid group at the second position. Ring opening reaction. So pyrrol undergoes ring opening reaction that is the ring is opened to form succinaldehyde dioxide on refluxing it with ethanolic hydroxyl amine. So you can see here, this 5-membered pyrrol ring is getting opened and we will get this succinaldehyde dioxide. So that's why it is called as ring opening reaction. These are some of the medicinal compounds that contain pyrrol nucleus. So we have this Procyclidine. Procyclidine is an anti-muscarinic agent and it is used in the treatment of Parkinsonism. 
Then we have nicotine. Nicotine is an alkaloid which is obtained from leaves of Nicotiana tobacum. And then we have this tolmetin drug. Tolmetin is basically a non-steroidal anti-inflammatory agent. So you can see here, all these are containing the pyrrole as a heterocycle. So these are some of the references for this pyrrole. That is, you can either refer heterocyclic chemistry by Joule and Mills, or you can refer the heterocyclic chemistry by Macolm, that is by RSC publication. So thank you for patient listening and happy learning. Like, share and subscribe my channel.